in bad sorts here. I took a little jolt and have managed to get myself hopelessly lost. I am staying in Strawberry. If you could just guide me back. Can't think of a good reason to say no. Okay, uh, what's up guys? It's your boy, Rob. I got it back with some more uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. I, I said that shit pretty fucking quick. I'm getting quick at that, but, uh, yeah, um, so I just ran, ran, not, not ran over, I ran into this guy, and he wants me to lead him to Strawberry, which is exactly where I'm going for Michael Bell, so I might as well just, oh, thank you, thank might you, as well sir. help him. Well, after you, what possessed me to come out here, I'll never know. <laughs> What are you doing out here anyway? It clearly ain't your natural habitat. I uh, no, I'm just visiting. I, I, I'm from New York City, actually. You don't say. Oh, yes. There was some talk at the country club about this burgeoning little resort town called Strawberry. So I thought it might be quite the trip to see what all the fuss was. Perhaps make a few investments while it was still undervalued. Turns out I was made the fool. Not enjoying it, Dan? It's a town of splinters, if you could call it much of a town at all. I'd hardly stepped off the carriage and I'd taken in the whole place. Mm. I suppose some might call it charming. <laughs> Let me tell you, charm is not worth much these days. You show me a timber frame shack and I'll show you Broadway. And meanwhile you have... How, how far are we actually? We're not that far. We're pretty good. Have this... Mayor, a quite intolerable blowhard. A little bespoke woodwork, and he thinks this is a cultural hub? The man's completely deluded. Well, I should give him some credit. He must be quite the salesman. He did get me out here, after all. More fool me. Now I'm tromping through the leaves in the muck with some cowboy. Uh, no offense. Little taken. Yes, that's it. Oh yes, this does look familiar. Yep, that's it right there. That's good that it looks familiar then, because we're very close. I gotta pull over. Let this guy get on the side of the road. What the hell? Oh, squirrel. Come on, let's pick it up, pork chop. Oh, are we close to town? Come on, pork chop, let's go. Sir, you've rescued me from the depths. You seem quite the resourceful sort, sir. If for some reason you plan to spend any time in Strawberry, you may want to look into that gabbing mayor. Something is definitely off with him. Oh. All right. Well, keep that in mind. Okay, I think that m might include like some kind of quest or a robbery. I'd be so happy to see this pole peep. Oh, we're here in Strawberry. Actually, because I know what this mission does. I won't complain about New York again. Let me tell you. Well, that's good. Uh, New Yorkers. Jesus. Yeah. Out of my way. Bro, you're in my way, my my man. You you are in my way. Now you're causing me. All right, all right, all right, just, just. Yes, I would like to buy a newspaper. No? Fine. Damn asshole. He's like, out of my way. Hold on a minute, actually. I need to carbine and then shoddy for the body. Oh, and that man just stepped straight in some horse dookie. 
and I just did it too. I heard it. All right, let's let's see. What has Michael Bell gotten himself into? Yeah. Hello, sir. I've uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the trail of a dangerous gang. Como Driscoll. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got in a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mick, so maybe them's your boys. You can look right enough when we hang them. Thank you, sir. Well, I know what to do. Let me out of here, you maggots! Arthur! Arthur! Hello, old friend. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> you gonna get me out of here? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh, I ain't joking, cowpoke. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months. And now, I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. Well, you gotta do something. Why? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people wanting to see you swing. You got to do something, Arthur. Gotta stick up the mask. I know what to do. I got you, fam. Yes! Hook that over the bars. See if you can pull them off. What a modern disaster this is gonna be. Just pull that lever. Come on. How about that, you little prick? How about that? Headshot to your ass.
something of mine. My guns. I showed him, and I'll show the rest of this town! You have really lost it, this time. I mean, I wanted to hit him with a headshot, but all right. That guy was shooting at me, so he had it coming. Ooh, right through the eye. Could you get the one that's actually shooting at you, please? Okay, really, and then you're gonna shoot two times. Got him. We're good. Okay. I think we might have one more to deal with. One more posse. Yeah, there's one more right in front of us. Stop. What are you doing, horse? Stay on the damn road. This is the only part I hate about the game is when you're aiming, the horse will not follow the damn road. That was some good shooting, Morgan. I gotta hand it to you. What the hell was that you pulled back there? Got a bit wild, all right. Wild? Making a house call in the middle of all that? Ain't much I care about more than those guns. That much is clear. Who was that fella? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't end well. I saw how it goddamn ended. He was gonna let me hang. I'm starting to wish I had. And you owe Lenny, too. If he hadn't found us in time... Yes, we'll all be thanked profusely, I promise. Yeah, well, you're lucky Dutch has got your back. Some unknown reason. I think we finally lost him. Well, I hope so. I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. And thank you. There I was, having a dull day only for you. To liven it up by letting me help you shoot up <laughs> half a town. You're a funny fella, Arthur. Real funny. Why you act all sour all the yeah, time? Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court jester? All right, listen. I'm sorry, but we're family now. Arthur, you and me. Sons of Dutch makes us brothers. Sometimes brothers make mistakes. Now I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back at Strawberry. Come see me. Maybe I can make things up to you. You ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offering. <clears throat> Bye now. Yeah. All right, we got the off-handed holster. Nice. Two sidearms at once. Bless our meek. Damn it. I did not get gold. <laughs> Committing serious crimes will cause towns to go into lockdown for a while. This is shown by Red Area on the pause map. Which, uh, right now, Strawberry is on lockdown. So, uh, actually, hold on a minute. I'm like right next to. I didn't think I was that close. But I'm right next to Javier Escuela, so let's go ahead and do that right here, right now. Do I have a bell? I 
they automatically gave me a damn bounty. Hold on. How much money do I got? I got 23 bucks. I cannot clear that. I have my bandana on. If you have your bandana on, they don't... What? I had my bandana on the whole time, and they... Now they just can straight up see me no matter what? Great. I can't even pay off my own bounty. Damn it, I had to freaking make my gun gold, now did I? I just had to make my gun gold. I just couldn't wait until after Micah to make it gold. God damn it. I'm a damn idiot. I'm a damn fool. I know about this guy. I know about this guy. This guy will give me some money. I'm pretty sure. I hope. Brother, let me get some cash. I I it. Hey, mister. Oh. Hello. Why is it day, isn't it? Sure. What a country. I'm working on a project. Photography. Yeah, I guess that, bit. <laughs> of course. Wildlife. That's my thing. Well, that's what I want to be my thing. If I have to take another picture of a grumpy housefrau or pompous middle-class burger, I will feed myself to the lions. Stand here. Here? Just... There. Albert Mason. Arthur Morgan. Pleasure. I'm trying to find and capture images of our great predators before our greatest predators Kill them all and stick them on some clubhouse wall. Good luck with that. Yes, not the easiest. But, well, I love a challenge. The trick is to leave a big load of meat and relax and pray they don't mistake me for lunch. Oh, good heavens. My bag, that thing is robbing me. Oh, good heavens. Don't worry. That thing is a coyote. Sneaky one, too. Wildlife photographer. Oh, I got this coyote. Don't worry about that. I got this coyote. This coyote don't you know what's about to hit him. Good Lord. Pussy. This is what I'd call a robbery gone wrong, coyote. Oh, bitch. Get back to Mason quickly. Maybe I can get that gold medal and get some good cash. Let me get enough cash to clear my bounty. I usually never had this problem. I usually be able to clear my bounty easily. Got your, Got your bag. Oh, thank you. Thank you, sir. A bag full of meat will tend to bring out the worst in the local population. You are a gentleman. The bag also had a lot of my supplies. You've saved me days. I can't thank you enough. I'm... I'm, thank you. Don't worry about it. I'm, uh, you take care, sir. I ain't the one trying to get myself eaten. I realize I am a fool. Forgive me. And thank you very much once again. Money? Money? Damn it, no money! I thought he would have given me some cash. I need to get it. I need to hope that there's a bank robbery. Oh, you know what? That Hosea mission will give me a pretty good amount of cash. Luckily, this is, um... This is, a uh, This is West Elizabeth. And we're in, uh, New Hanover. So we never, we never go to West Elizabeth. There's never a camp in West Elizabeth. So we, we, we just, we, we out here. We out here. All out here. It's gonna be a little difficult getting to Javier. Hopefully, if I get lucky. But yeah, if I get, if I get lucky, I'll uh, okay, boy. I'll be able to um, just straight out make it without getting spotted by anything. Uh, something's gonna happen. 
That could be a lawman. I don't think it is, but can't be too careful. Yep. All right. Yes, I know. Avoid, avoid roads. Just hit, just make a beeline for them. Don't, don't. Just, just avoid all roads that you can. Stay far away from roads. Blackwise and surrounding areas is locked down. Shown by a red area called map. You will become wanted seen by law in the area. Which, thank the Lord, I probably won't. Hopefully. Damn it. I pressed square to jump and he didn't do it. So now I gotta jump over three obstacles in 15 seconds. Which all I gotta do is just go to like a farm and jump over three fences. Here. Hold up. Here we are. I think this is the only time I gotta touch black water. How many? A lot. Uniforms everywhere. You see Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? Who knows? Just hey. keep your eyes open. <clears throat> Where is that little Irish bastard? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Anyone been in the black water, see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah. pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Oh, well, we got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's gonna remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. Well, they want to trial him publicly. Gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or cut him loose. We're not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Scaldings, boys, are moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess we need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side and then we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government or people whom the government like seem to be very angry. Sure. Well, we'll rescue Sean and then we'll get ourselves lost good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. Just in case. Because that's how this thing is supposed to work. Find the boat. Alright. Oh, whoa. Alright, Arthur. Arthur can melt me. guns through him. Let's see if we can track down this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Yes, south of the river West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. There, look. I think that's our boat. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. Whoa. What the hell are you doing, Warhorse? Keep your guns away until we know it's Sean, okay? I know what you two are like. You think they can see us? If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. But without me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Maybe. <laughs> anyway, we should keep it down. Let's go. Stay with them. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute.
Push up, come on. Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. Sure. Get your binoculars out. Let's see what we're dealing. Okay. We're Thank here. You. Ah. Wow. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skeldon's boys, but I hear they're a big crew. And wild. Built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep. That's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Javier, back up, man. Damn. Sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. Wait. Let's get in the river. Wait until he's got them off guard before crossing. Hold up, he's doing his thing. Gentlemen! Gentlemen, excuse me, dear brothers, my wife is taken ill, gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. You she take the one on the left. Let's go now. Keep down. I, I'm beside myself. I, if I lose, if I lose Bessie, I lose everything. Oh, calm down, mister. I, I can't, I can't. I, I'm having a fit. <laughs> Get on. Get on. Come on, let's get up there. A pleasure as always, gentlemen. I think you have it from here. Kill three enemies in two seconds with only throwing knives. Shit. Shit. You know who you're talking to. The one that's gonna fuck up. We got two halfway up the canyon to deal with. Okay. Okay, you mean all those boots you got there, eh? Those are very nice. Who's the guy you got them from? Is he alive still? Mm. Come on, focus. Oh. Damn it, damn it. 
I hope that was it. Because if it wasn't, I don't know. No, not the journal. Stop doing that. Stop, stop with the journal. Oh, no. no, I didn't get it. Crouch down, down. And you need to die. Thank you. Anybody else? No. Come on, come on, that had to be it. That was 10 seconds, I know it. My man, I'm gonna need you to die, please. Fuck, boy. Fuck, boy. No, I don't. I need my hat. Come on, Charles. Get him, Charles. There you go, Charles. Fucker. Fucker. Damn it. Okay, I'm gonna have... I had to try for the uh, knife kills later, obviously. Because it really doesn't want to give it to me. Even though I know damn well that that was 10 seconds. I know that was 10 seconds. No, I, I swear I hate how the dead eyes are literally picking the targets for me. I really hate it. I don't know what else I can do. I got anything for dead eye. That damages the core. I don't need the core damaged. Take center then. Let's take these equipment. Army of these uh, really? Javier, and you're gonna take the cover that I was going for, you fucking idiot. Still time. Nah, screw it. I'll, I'll freaking do those kills later. Stand still, Arthur. Stop shaking so much. You got arthritis? I thought that was TNT. See, he shoots three. Why is he shooting three? I only pressed it twice. gonna do what now? Uh. He, first of all, he won't even fucking move. He, second of all, he won't even heal either. Thirdly, why is he shooting so many times? This is fucking bullshit. I swear, this is the one complaint I have. Why does he shoot 
so freaking many times. I pressed the thing twice. He shoots three times. And why did it change my outfit? Why it's this game came out in October. These glitches should be fixed by now. Why did it change my outfit? I guess. Fuck it, I'm just running straight in because they gonna notice me anyways, and Javier's gonna take my fucking shit anyways. Charles, you couldn't move out of my damn way so I could. Hold on. Hold on a minute. Charles. Charles. I'm gonna need you. God damn it, I can't fucking hit him. Fucking bitch. You need to move the fuck out of my way next time. Or I swear I will not. I will blow your fucking head off. Fucking prick. Less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Do I get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper I can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Okay, come on. <clears throat> Have I got stories for you? Yeah, I can't wait. <clears throat> I imagine y'all missed me a lot. But fear not, the joy is back in your lives now. Great, senior dickhead's back. Now, that's, okay, stop moving, horse. Stop moving, horse. Stop it. Stop, oh my God. Damn! Stop! Th there. We'll just fucking leave. We'll just straight up freaking leave because you're bringing an ass hat. I need to leap number one. Safe custom outfit one, that's what's the problem. Come on, horse! You really? You, you don't want to go? Alright. Just go, god damn. What, this game's getting on my nerves. I'm actually going to have to stop recording because it's really pissing me off. So I'm going to just see you guys in the next episode, which I'm not recording today because it's pissed me the hell off right now. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.